then you will soon have better habits in place, which will lead to a leaner and healthier you in 2022. Hey man, Gary Walker here and welcome back for another video. Did you know every little choice you make has consequences? Some of those are good and some are bad. In today's video, I want to share some tips for powerful little choices you can make daily that will help you get into amazing shape this year. But first, please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so. And then also, I'm gonna give you a special request. Please leave me a comment with your fitness goals for 2022. I would love to see what your goals are and I'll also use some of those comments to see what you may need help with so I can record some videos to help you reach your goals quicker this year. All right, let's get into the five little choices you can make to help you get lean this year. Choice number one, drink more water with your meals man no soda no juice no sugary drinks drinking water will keep you hydrated and help your body function optimally there are numerous other benefits as well water makes you feel full water is an awesome appetite suppressant and keeps you from overeating at mealtime which is huge water also enhances fat loss by helping to flush out the byproducts as fat breaks down all right Water even helps keep your energy levels high, which people don't even think about. And it helps with cramping and aids in breaking down food so that body assimilates nutrients properly. So yes, this one little choice you make can make a huge difference in your fitness goals this year. Okay, second little choice you can make to help you get lean is to hack your mindset. Something I always say to my online clients is you need to reset your mindset. Don't say I have to go work out today or I have to eat this or have to eat that. Instead, shift to a positive mindset. I get to go work out today and I get to eat healthy today. Remember, these are things that not everyone can do. So get excited to work out, man, and be thankful you have quality food to eat and realize you alone are in control of your own fitness journey. Another mental hack is take a serving of anabolic ATP once you wake up or just before you leave work. This will give you energy and also put you into that I can't turn back now mindset because I've already taken my pre-workout. The last thing you wanna do and take it from me, I've done it before, unfortunately, the last thing is take your pre-workout and then not go work out. Another mental hack is using visualization. Basically, take a few minutes to see yourself going through your workout. See yourself getting stronger, getting leaner, and imagine yourself the way you want to look. This will help jumpstart your endorphins, which will help improve your mood and get you ready for your workout. You can also do a five to 10 minute low intensity warm up. This will help get some blood flowing throughout your body and elevate your heart rate to get you ready and primed for your workout. Okay, another little choice that can really get things amped up is listen to music. Update your playlist with your favorite music that gets you fired up and get ready to go to work, man. Music naturally boosts dopamine, the neurotransmitter that drives your brain's reward system. Music can also make you feel energetic and give you an extra boost during your workout. So if you're really trying hard to make 2022 the year you get lean, then up your game and start blasting the music, man. All right, this wouldn't be a good list if I didn't include a nutrition tip. Have a go-to meal and snack. When you get hungry between meals, have a plan. Have a meal prepared or a healthy snack that you enjoy. The worst thing to happen is you start getting hungry and you aren't prepared. Typically, the longer you go without eating, the more you start to crave foods that aren't in your diet. This can lead to frustration, grumpiness, or becoming hangry and can also lead to eating fast foods or comfort foods or foods that will completely derail your progress. This is why I always recommend meal prepping. 
You can be as simple or as elaborate as you want with your meal prep, meaning you can have three or four emergency meals prep, or you can have a full blown week of meals prep. And don't forget the snacks, man, because snacks are gonna be key. Try to eliminate all unhealthy snacks from your environment and make sure you have some go-to snacks that you like. This can be like Greek yogurt and berries, hard boiled eggs, beef jerky, high fiber, protein bars, fruit or turkey wraps. These are all good options, but not your only options. Just make sure you have healthy snacks that you enjoy eating. Okay, for the last little choice tip, choose a meal cut off time, then stick to it. For example, make your last meal at eight or 7.30 or something like that, and then don't stray from it. Doing this consistently will establish this as a habit. Another tip that I'll add is this, make your last meal a high protein and high fiber meal. And make sure you drink water with the meal. Protein can help you feel full faster and longer and fiber has the exact same effect. So combining these two along with 10 to 12 ounces of water will keep the cravings down and keep you from snacking before you go to bed. All right, man, I know some of these tips might take some getting used to, but if you make these small little choices consistently, then you will soon have better habits in place, which will lead to a leaner and healthier you in 2022. Again, I just wanna remind you, leave a comment below, man, and let me know what your 2022 fitness goals are. I'd love to see which goals you're going to conquer this year. Thanks for watching this video, and as always, man, get busy, get after it, and God bless.